So, um, so uh, this was the source for Carol, and this is a poem I wrote um, shortly after my dad passed away. Um, there's a little visual to it. The only capital is his name, Bob. A poem for my dad, Bob. Sunlight's kiss sparkles water behind the no trespassing sign. Red and white, up and down. Keep the line taut, dad smiles. Checks for cops, edges back down. The steep incline of dirt and concrete. Best place to fish, five minutes from our house. See it bobbing? Excited brown eyes squint up the hill and back at me. Watch it, watch it, watch it now. Reel in the line, good girl, keep it taut. Red and white, red and white, white and red. Up and down and under, snap. Reel it in, reel it in, you did real good. He shouts, heedless of getting caught. Like the fish that bites small five-year-old fingers, reeling it in. I show my dad, I bob my head up and down, showing my prized little pumpkin seed. And if you guys didn't see, this was on the front page of the Expert's mm -hmm. Time along with her matching poem. I mean, I have to say, they picked a good picture. Mm -hmm. I, so uh, Carol had me go through her pictures to pick one. And that one just stood out to me because I love the idea. And the, the title I kept, it's, the title of hers was Lotus Life Cycle. So I just swapped it, Life Cycle Lotus. Um, so I just felt that was really beautiful. Just the flower itself put so much um, emotion into it. So Life Cycle Lotus. Filth filters into roots, eating purest blooms. Lush blossoms provide carpet and repose for gods and prophets and aphids, flies, and frogs. White petals blush, their secret lies in dark, dirty waters. Purity comes from life's cycle and recycle. The world's waste suckled by hungry sprouts, sheltering bottom feeders, not immortals' fate. <laughs> <laughs>